no name. My first thought of it, no name, just a thing. Curious hands learning my body, a mysterious opening between legs. It was never talked about, <coughs> held no value, was not special, not meant to be respected or ignored or just be. Mom said, keep your hands away from it, dirty girl. Mm. Always self-conscious, what was wrong with it? Mm. Was I to reject this part of me? It was naughty, and I had no idea why. Society says, only let a man who says he loves you touch it after marriage. Mm. A high school boy defiled it. With his fist, a beer bottle, I remember blood. I didn't scream. Teens gossiped about it after, in halls, whispering slut because boys brag, and so obviously I am. He said I wanted it. I made excuses for everything about it to men who could not care less, who tried to control it, me, by using it, me, for their pleasure. I wasn't even an afterthought. Never talked to other women, assuming they are living in skin more comfortable than mine. It, a shameful, disgusting thing no positive role model or memory related to it. I survived, stopped abuse, learned forced touches are not love. Mm. Had a funeral for impure skeletons and built an altar of sensual adoration of love, filled it with self-esteem, fed myself patience, confidence, and custody. Realized well-being of body and mind, investing in my own worth makes self-love exquisite. Now, addicted to the power of valuing myself, mm. my identity no longer tied to the satisfaction of anyone but me. Belonging to myself, claiming a name for it. Hello, my name is Heather. Mm.